Hey guys, what's up? It's your girl Moosh, and I know it's been a while. Hello, <laughs> hi, and welcome to this new room. Uh, it took a second to paint it and stuff, and I am gonna fill it in. It's like The Sims, but in real life, you don't have mother load as a cheat code. So I gotta wait to get like a little couch and a rug. I have some artwork. Um, yeah, I'll show you guys that in another video. Anyways, we're gonna look at some interesting Craigslist postings, uh, listings, whatever you wanna call them, that are kinda funny. So I have a few on my phone, and for once I'm not filming with my phone, it's kinda nice, so get used to it. We'll do some updates in the chill room that I used to film in uh, eventually. Okay, loft server. My goodness, you're so darn lovely, and you appear to be very healthy. I wish you were my server. I look forward to visiting again. I just wonder, like, who's looking on Craigslist for, like, someone talking about them. I think it's really funny. Um, I'm sorry if any of my followers, like, post stuff on Craigslist. Like, okay, next. Foot rub, Roselle. <laughs> Ooh. I have been told by some women I give a great foot rub. If you have tired sore feet, I would like to give you a foot rub free. Must be over 55 or older. Specific taste. Yeah. I mean, who doesn't want a foot rub, but... Yeah, I don't want one from this guy. All right, beautiful woman at the bus stop. You are a very pretty woman at the bus stop in front of the Ace store on Wachung Avenue today, Sunday, like 12.30 p.m. I think you were waiting for the bus. <laughs> I was waiting in my car for the light to turn green and look at and turn green and look at you and when the light changed and passed in front of you we had eye contact <laughs> i would like to meet you please if you see this ad send me an email and we will mutually verify if we are talking to the right person <laughs> like bud <laughs> i don't think she gonna read this ever and like that's creepy I don't know what's creepier if like someone comes up to you while you're waiting for the bus or like they want to meet up on a Craigslist ad like <laughs> I don't know <laughs> Spanish woman at Safeway in Vancouver I felt you I know we should have talked you have strong energy they felt you <laughs> they felt you damn you got strong energy. Shit. <laughs> That's kind of intense. Man, I don't know. Craigslist is crazy. <laughs> Girl to pick up water. Linwood. 164th Street, Southwest. You wore a nice red sweet shirt and blue jeans. I filled my container before you and you asked if I had one container only. Yes, we caught eyes and my heart melted, but I couldn't talk to you there. I wanted to follow your car to a better situation that I could talk, but it wasn't nice to do. So we must have a chance to know each other. Bro, she just like asked if you had one container. <laughs> that is so scary. <laughs> I wonder how often this happens. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Looking for a brown girl at a gas station? Mission. Pardon? <laughs> I saw you at a gas station. You were selling car cleaning product. Your look took away my breath. I wish I could say hello to you, but I was a little shy. And you were busy. Hopefully you are reading this message and contact me. 
Yeah, she's totally reading the Craigslist listings. Canadian babe driving south. Uh, yesterday lunchtime, we were both driving south on I-5. You looked smoking hot. You signaled your back wiper. <laughs> Seemed like you were flirting back, but I had to exit. Until the next flirty road encounter. <laughs> Oh, flirting with your windshield wipers. <laughs> Bro, she was probably just wiping rain off or like cleaning her car. Okay. I'm, I'm going to think twice the next time I use my windshield wipers, especially my rear end one. <laughs> Never know. All right. McDonald's King Street, new girl. This guy be watching for the new girls. You're the newer girl at McDonald's on King Street. I got a cinnamon roll. It was your fourth day. You are the cutest thing I've ever seen and I couldn't stop staring. I hope you see this. I kind of hope she sees this too so she like quits her job because that's freaky. <sighs> it was your fourth day. <laughs> Hello, why haven't you noticed me? <laughs> All right, fuzzy. Hi there. <laughs> Hi there. Looking for a fuzzy lady. Looking for all natural. Hey bro, I'm a fuzzy lady. And I'm all natural, baby. Oh man, that is fucking scary. <laughs> Man, like, it's kind of weird, like, who, not to say anything's wrong with body hair, but, like, it's interesting that, like, some people like fuzzy ladies. Nothing wrong with that. Like I said, I am a fuzzy lady. But I do groom myself quite often. All right. McKnight viewing area. To the girl in the red car I saw at 420-ish. Uh, as I was leaving the McKnight viewing area on Friday, June 23rd, you look might my cute. <laughs> Mighty cute. <laughs> Message me if you see this. Uh, okay. How many more I got? I got a few more. Thai food glance. To the spiral perm brunette who sat with parents, I think. Across from me in the back of the restaurant, I'm attracted. Gray fox glasses, black shirt. You, purple top. Program coordinator, I overheard. <laughs> That's spooky. <laughs> All right. He was listening. Black Honda CRV on QEW. I was driving down QEW West in my blue big rig on Friday around noon and you pulled up beside me with your pants down. I honked and you tried to slow down beside me, but traffic d drifted us apart. Let me know if you see this. I'm interested in seeing more. <laughs> oh, <laughs> why were her pants down? Was she mooning you or were like her pants just off while she was driving? If you see this, I'm just interested to know what was going on. You don't have to show me more. I just want to know what was happening. YMCA Park Avenue Sauna Showers. This is a long shot, but here goes nothing. I see you all the time at YMCA Gym Showers and Sauna. You were there this afternoon. Your beefy, hairy, bearded wear... Wear gold cross. Okay. Your beefy, hairy, wear, oh. Your beefy, hairy, bearded, wear gold cross, have beautiful green eyes, seem so warm and friendly. We've shared glances numerous times. If this is you or anyone knows this guy, let me know. I'd love to get to know you better, even just as a friend, if not interested. Aww. He thinks you could just be friends. Okay. <laughs> Blonde-haired angel. 
in Toronto. Club Coda, last Saturday, June 3rd. You are in a beautiful red dress looking like an angel. <laughs> Me, just a random guy with curly hair, dancing on my own, enjoying the music. And then something wonderful happens. We saw each other. There was an instant spark and we tried to catch each other's moves. All that joy was interrupted by those bastards, unfortunately. <laughs> if you are reading this, I want you to know that you are out of this world and I would love to get to know you. Those bastards. I wonder if it was like her boyfriend or brothers or her friends. Those bastards. What happened? What happened in Club Coda? Was it like bodyguards? Were those the bastards? What happened? All right, Taco Bell. You're tall. Oh, <laughs> you're the tall, beautiful woman who works at Taco Bell. I asked you if the rooftop patio was worth going to, and you said yes. It was really nice up there, but would be better if you joined me. Maybe next time. Wow. Romantic on the rooftop patio. Ooh. <laughs> Taste of Little Italy Festival in Toronto. You are a cute young lady working at the patio at the Bella Vista during the Sunday afternoon of the festival. I ate just next to your patio and I could not stop thinking about you for the rest of the rest of the day. Never done this before, use this site, but for this for the site for this but i respect your hustle waitress waitress jobs are hard as hell yeah yeah they are uh i used to be a waitress make really good money but it is a lot of work uh respond if you see this please respond with your hair color and what you were wearing i was wearing a racing jersey and was with two of my friends Sorry, man. I don't think she cares. And if she was, like, nice to you, like, that's just her job. <laughs> All right. This is my last one. CSI Spadina. Front door, Toronto. I opened the door for you. You smiled, and we exchanged a glance. Felt like this. there was more to the look than just a thank you for getting the door. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, caught me off guard as I was standing next to my boss. Been thinking about the moment ever since. Shot in the dark. <laughs> Bro. Okay. Um, I'm going to edit and post this ASAP. Because it's been like, feels like almost two months since I posted a video. So hope everyone's doing well. Um, yeah, maybe next time there will be something on the walls. I don't know about furniture yet. It's a hard life. It's a hard financial life sometimes. You know, one thing after another. Um, update on Riley, he had a tooth pulled, so he's recovering. I'd, I'd go pick him up, but he's tired, and I'm gonna let him sleep. All right, guys, I will post a video soon. Hopefully this one. Take good care of yourselves. Stay hydrated and all that. Peace and love to you all. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Love you guys. Peace.